Do you like food, wool, or happiness? Well today, let's make a farm that gets us all three. What is up guys, it is Farzy here, and today, we are gonna teach you how to make a sheep farm. I've made a cow farm, a pig farm, a chicken farm, so it's only fitting that we do a sheep farm and complete all the basic animals in Minecraft. Okay, here are the blocks you're going to need. You're gonna need two chests, three hoppers, one observer, one button, about 30 stone blocks, one stone stair, five dispensers, four trap doors, seven glass blocks, one water bucket, two lava buckets, 12 of redstone, four repeaters, two shares, and at least two sheep. All right, let's start out by placing down five horizontal blocks like this. On each end, come down two, then raise the whole thing up three more for a total of four. Now take out your chests. You're gonna look at the bottom middle block, go a space of one, and put a chest in the ground right there, then come off one more in the front to make a double chest like this. Now, on these back three blocks, make these all hoppers feeding in to that chest. Take out your observer, we're gonna break the middle bottom block, go around the back, and put the observer on the middle hopper. The red dot is facing out the back, and in the front, you're gonna see the hopper's face. Now take out your button and put it on the face of the observer. Now take out your stair, put it upside down above the observer. Now take out your dispensers. We're gonna put two next to the observer right here on the back wall, then two more up one on the side like this. In the upper side dispensers, we're gonna put down lava buckets like so, on the middle lower ones, shears like so. Take out your blocks again, go to the top level and you're gonna fill in all but one of these blocks, the middle block. Keep this open, we're gonna feed sheep in through this hole. Now take out your trap doors. You're gonna put two on the bottom covering up the hoppers, then two more in the top corners, but make sure you put them on the side where the hole is. That way, when you close them, you can cover the sides like that. If you're doing it like this, that's wrong. If it's like this, that's wrong. Make sure you can cover up the middle like that. I'll explain why later. Now take out your glass, make an upside down U shape on the front like this, and now we are ready to go to the back and work on the redstone. Look in between the two dispensers and go up one. Break it, put redstone in there, and bring it down two more. Now go out to the sides, and then you're going to link these up with the side dispensers like this. Do it on both sides. Now when you do that, and you go back to the front and you hit the button, you're gonna see you get lava and shear shearing at the same time, which is great, but if we have sheep inside here and we do that, the wool gets burned because there's no delay in the time. So the lava gets the wool and there's no wool to be saved. So to combat that, go to the back with your repeaters and facing out in each direction, you're gonna put down two of them and then you're gonna put them both on the max amount of ticks like this. Now if we go back to the front and put the sheep back in, you're going to see it is going to work flawlessly. Boom, they get sheared, then they get burned, and we save all the loot. And the final thing to do is go to the top, take out your water bucket, and place it on that back lower block just like that. So that is the whole farm, but now you're gonna wanna know how to get sheep inside here, how to fill it up, and that's what we're gonna cover next. Now, as you guys already know, the main idea is to get sheep down inside these lower pens so you can hit the button and make the farm work. But you gotta get sheep up top first. So build a ladder or something, build a staircase, get at least two adult sheep inside of here. Then you're gonna start breeding them. I think the max mob count in one by one spaces is like 25, something like that. So get about 20 to 25 sheep inside here. When you get enough, then you can start opening up these doors. When you open up these doors, now any baby sheep will start to pop through and fall down the side like this. Then when the sheep grow up down there, then you hit the button. So you see the babies, they won't die. They're fine. But if you put an adult in there, then they get sheared, they die, you get the loot, that's it guys. 
Now this farm is very similar to my cow farm, which I actually have right over here for reference. So if you're very confused or anything, go watch the cow farm, okay? It's very similar. But guys, it really isn't that hard. The only thing that's really difficult is just getting the sheep in here originally. But once you get a couple in here, it's literally just go up there, breed them, breed them, breed them, breed them, then hit the button when the babies fall through. All right, guys, that is it. I hope you enjoy this amazing farm. I'm also going to link all my other animal farms down below. So there's cows, there's pigs, there's chickens, and now there's sheep. So there is no excuse to not have an amazing animal farm in Minecraft. So on that note, thanks so much for watching. Make sure to like, subscribe, do all the good stuff, and I will talk to you guys next time. So until then, goodbye.